बच्चे बहुत ही क्रियाशील होते हैं वो हमेशा कुछ न कुछ करते रहते हैं करते करते सीखना ही उनका सहज स्वभाव है उनकी इस चपलता में मौलिकता की छाप मिलती है उसमें आप कहीं ना कहीं बाल प्रतिभा की झलक पाएंगे कहिए है ना ये बाल प्रतिभा का कमाल करके सीखना ही तो विज्ञान है इन बाल वैज्ञानिकों के लिए आई एम मोहिनी पांडे ऑफ कामल स्कूल दिगवादी सी एफ आर आई धनबाद रिप्रेजेंटिंग माई स्टेट झारखंड इन दिक्सटीन नेशनल साइंस कांग्रेस ऑर्गेनाइज इन नागालैंड द फोकल थीम ऑफ दिस ईयर इज द अर्थ आर होम explore care and share the name of my project is weather forecasting which deals with the advanced forecasting of the weather and is solely based on predicting the weather on the basis of observatory survey which can even be well understood by the local and the common people residing in the rural areas now let's get ahead with the project and know what weather forecasting actually is also i shall introduce you about the aims and all the other topics of my project weather forecasting it is an application of science and technology to predict the state of the atmosphere for the future time and a given location the chaotic nature of the atmosphere and the massive computational power required to analyze the atmosphere is not much competent to predict the weather in olden days weather prediction was not done by the meteorological departments but by the common people by their observation this project is also based on predicting the weather on the basis of observatory survey now i shall tell you about the aims of this project nowadays there's a need for everything a thirst for everything as science and technology are progressing people have to be more advanced to cope up with the latest developments in this long scenario where are the poor people where are the common people they are left far behind in almost all the major aspects weather is one among them 3/4 nearly 3/4 of our population resides in the villages or the rural areas and till date most of them have been deprived of getting the complete and timely information of the weather so the central need that this project covers is to make the people aware of the present weather conditions so that they can predict their own weather in the future time using their basic knowledge there are various other aims of this projects study of this project in deep will surely give us fruitful results by doing this project we can get a systematized universal effort systematized universal approach of the ability of predicting the weather of the different kinds of people in the entire country and the entire world now let me come to the planning the planning of selection of topic the planning of selection of topic was done on basis of what the present time demands the thirst of the present time number 2 area of work to be focused the area of work to be focused was our own school carmel school digwadi place of work the place of work for our project was the library time of action plan was from the 15th of october to 10th of november 2008 group members to be selected all the group members were selected according to their capabilities now i shall tell you about the questionnaires that we prepared and the observations that we did planning of questions to be put alike we prepared a total of 10 questions and distributed it among our classmates to be answered i shall tell you the questions and also give you the analysis of those questions but before that let me introduce you about the data analysis all the questions that we prepared were given to our classmates to be answered and the weather was predicted for the next day that is the 4th of november now i shall tell you the questions and the analysis 
Did you see dew drops on the grass in the morning? It is predicted that if we see dew drops on the grass in the morning means that the air is not moisture laden and humidity range is less meaning that there are less chances of rain and since, since more than 50% of our students gave their answer in favor of the question so it can be concluded that there will be fair weather the next day. Number two, did you see ants clustering to build their hills? It is a simple animal observation that ants cluster to build their hills just before a rain. But since most of our classmates did not give the answer in favor of the question, so once again we concluded that there will be fair weather the next day. Number three, were the clouds going in different directions? It is predicted that when the clouds are going in different directions, it means that they are not stable, they are moving. The sky is overcast. It can be said that there are more and more chances of rainfall. But here, since most of our classmates did not give the answer in favor of the question, so we predicted that next day will be a fair weather. Did you see a clear moon last night? According to this question, if there's a clear moon in the night, then there's no ring around the moon. The moon is not overcast by clouds, meaning to say that there's a fair weather. Here, more than 50% of our students gave their answer in favor of the question. So we concluded that there will be a fair weather the next day. Did you see birds flying in the sky? It is a simple animal observation. Birds fly in the sky when the sky is clear and pleasant. And here also, since more than 50% of our students gave their answer in favor of the question. So we concluded that there will be fair weather. Like this, we did the analysis of rest five questions too. The prediction done finally. After the entire data analysis of the questions, the prediction that was done finally was that there will be fair weather on the next day, that is the 4th of November. Temperature and humidity range will be less and less fluctuation in the weather indicates a fair one. Now, at the end I want to give a solution to the problem of predicting the weather. I want to say just one thing. In this project, we predicted the weather for a single day and it came true. I want to say that as we go on predicting the weather, we can develop more such techniques which are more scientifically proven and more reliable. I do not say that we must totally rely on these techniques to predict the weather, but as we go on doing so, we can really develop techniques which are more scientifically proven. Because when people of the rural areas will understand how to predict the weather by simple techniques, then we can at least lessen the burden or the damage caused to our Mother Earth. Thank you. ये उमड़ते घुमड़ते हुए बादल ये घनघोर घटाएं आकाश में चमचमाती हुई बिजली ये सभी के सभी तैयारी में जुटे हैं स्वागत की जी हाँ स्वागत वर्षा रानी का कितना इंतजार कराती है ये वर्षा रानी पर कब तक करें इनकी प्रतीक्षा काश के कुछ ऐसा हो जाए कि प्रतीक्षा में समय गवाए बिना ही पता लग जाए कि वर्षा रानी आ गई है इनका आगमन हो गया है आ, अब ऐसा कर दिखाया है इस बाल वैज्ञानिक ने रेन अलार्म इज अ प्रोटेक्टिव डिवाइस यूज्ड टू सेफ गार्ड दी हाईली सेंसिटिव इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स अगेंस्ट रेन इट इज बीइंग यूज्ड इन द फील्ड ऑफ एटॉमिक रिसर्च एंड इन कंप्यूटर्स व्हेन द रॉड कंडक्ट द स्पीकर इट गिव्स द साउंड विद एन इंडिकेशन ऑफ रेन In this circuit, these are two rain sensor rods, which are connected to the battery. And when they come in contact with water, the circuit completes, and the current flows through the circuit. The speaker converts the electrical energy into sound wave. When we dip rain sensor in water. or when rain falls on it the alarm start giving sound and hence indicates the rain bhai va vigyan ki padhai ka kitna sahi upyog varsha ke aate hi ye alarm baj utha bachchon ki karamat ka hi kamal hai ye sab bachchon ki gatividhiyon mein to maulikta milti hi hai पर उनके नटखटपन में भी सृजनशीलता की झलक मिलती है 
भाई वाह विज्ञान की पढ़ाई का कितना सही उपयोग है My project is weather indicating flower. This project is based on color change produced in potassium permanganate by the moisture in air. The method to do is this: first we cut the flower of blotting paper like this, and and fix the and fix the stick under it. Then take the potassium permanganate in a beaker. If we dip this flower into the beaker. After some time, when it is dry, if the color become dark brown like this, it means that the sunny weather will be formed. If the color become light brown like this, if it means that the moderate climate will be formed on next day. If the both colors are mixed, it means that the rainy weather will be formed. Can you understand? Yes. In bal vyajnikon ki saphalata, chir sthai ho sakti hai. यदि इनमें से कुछ चुनिंदा मॉडलों को सुधारा संवारा जाए उन्हें गांव गांव और घर घर पहुंचाकर इन नन्हे वैज्ञानिकों की कल्पना को साकार किया जाए तभी उनमें छिपी हुई प्रतिभा का विकास होगा उनके भीतर का वैज्ञानिक सामने आएगा एक उभरते हुए बाल वैज्ञानिक